Yo, what the fuck is up, you twat? Welcome to Unimoto fucking vlogs, you twat. Fuck. Oh my god, I'm so offended by swear words. Oh my god. Imagine being offended by swear words. Imagine being offended by swear words in 2023, you little pussy. Shut up. Right, so welcome back to the channel. Today's Wednesday. I wasn't going to do a vlog today because my arm was fucked. Like, I, I've not broken my arm right, but I can't move my arm. Like, it's gone all numb. Like, I think I've slept on it or something. Ah! Out, you see what I mean? It's painful. Like, literally. I can't lift my arm up like that. I can't do it. So, I'm having to vlog with my other arm because I feel like normally I would be vlogging with this arm, but I'm obviously not going to be vlogging with this arm. So, obviously, it is Wednesday. Whopper Wednesday. Skirt! And uh, we are going to guess Burger King because it's Whopper Wednesday and that is what we do on a Wednesday we go to Burger King we show up at Burger King we pull up to BK on Whopper Wednesday that's how we do on the Unimoto channel that doesn't rhyme oh my God. now normally I, I discovered a new life hack to get across NPC territory if you, if you don't want to go across NPC territory Unimoto you can get the bus to BK across NPC territory but guess what I can't be arsed doing that today. I can't be arsed walking to the bus stop, then wait for the bus, then getting on the bus, and everyone's staring at me. You gotta find a seat on the bus, and everyone's fucking staring. I just, I can't be bothered. But it's no better when all the drivers are staring at me in NPC territory. I don't like that. You know what I mean? Like, I don't like it when all the drivers just, it's such an awkward situation, though, isn't it? You know, when you're walking down the side of the road, and all the drivers are just stuck in traffic and they're like staring at you. I'm gonna be honest, I don't like it. Like, you know what, Santa? Fuck you. I'm not in the fucking mood today. Get on your X-17 and fuck off. Santa's gonna put me on the naughty list now. So basically the elves are gonna see that and they're gonna snitch, the elves are gonna watch this and they're gonna snitch to Santa. They're gonna say, Santa, your Unimoto swore on his channel again. He's telling people to fuck off on his channel. We don't like swearing, it's 2023, we're so woke. We don't like swear words. Oh, Santa put him on the naughty list, we don't like that. Like, you know what I mean? It's just. No, Santa, I'm a grown man. I need to swear, I'm a grown adult. I'm sorry, it's in my vocabulary. I'm sorry, Santa, please don't put me on the naughty list. I want a good Christmas this year. You guys remember, you guys remember, it's the Maverick shit spot. The Maverick shit spot. Where's my apology, unique? Bro, so I've just noticed something, right? This guy drove past me in a mobility scooter, right? And it had like a shelter on it or whatever. And he was recording on his phone as, as it moves. So he has just got a shot of me because I literally looked into the lens of his phone. So that, that means that he's basically got a shot of me. So, yeah. I'm famous even more now, aren't I? Look at that. Oh, I hate this fucking, mate. I hate this fucking road. No, no one ever stops for you. No one ever stops for you. I hate this fucking road, man. Damn it. So now we found these Abando cans of cider. I believe that's Aldi cider. Cherry cider. And we have another one here. So if my assumptions are correct, this is a new button, right? A new button. Because I remember in my vlogs before, I remember I tried to press it and it didn't fucking work, but now there's a new one there, there's a new button, so... So great, let's go. I pay attention to things that most people ignore. Quite literally. Right, so now I'm doing a vlog in the hand, the, the arm that is not very stable. I'm still managing to do it quite well, so hooray, hooray for me. Uh, basically, you can probably tell by my voice that I've got a cold. Yes, I have got a cold. You know, if you're, if you're going to be observant and be like, you sound like you've got a cold. Have you got a cold? Yes, I have got a cold. I, get, I normally get a cold around about Dece December or January time. I've said this in my vlogs before, so I shouldn't need, need to have to explain it again. So I don't know if you guys could hear that, but it's like seagulls, right? And it reminded me, it gave me a flashback of the summertime the summertime in at the seaside you know in like saltburn or, Re or red car the ogs will remember those vlogs they will right so right now it's like 11 27 is that even lunchtime like can you even call that lunchtime so I want to know, drop a comment now, can you have your lunch at 11.27? Let me know. It was worth the trek, it's always worth the fucking trek. Home of the motherfucking Whopper, always worth the trek. I love you Burger King. We're here now, 
they got no other than the classic waffle. No, no ads, just the classic waffle. Yeah. Coca-Cola Classic, Phil. <laughs> so, oh, these are some nice watches. Oh, these are some nice watches. Oh, so I'm in one beyond right now, and I've got just one question Where are your trousers, Lucas? Eh? You should wear your trousers, man. That's public indecency. <laughs> Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. So obviously it's that time again, five days before Christmas. I think you know where this is about to go. I'm gonna get a haircut. Yeah, what the fuck is that, mate? What the fuck is that? It looks fucking horrifying, mate. What the fuck? Right, so basically I'm gonna go and get a trim somewhere. So until then, see you later. So here it is, voila, fresh trim and that, you know, had the beard trimmed as well. And I didn't go to my usual barbers because it was really, well, it wasn't that busy, but there was a few people in there. I thought, you know, why wait, why wait around? So I went to a different barbers and this barbers was actually cheaper than the one I normally go to. I'm starting to think he probably did that on purpose so that I, I go back, you know what I mean? I'm starting to think he might have charged me less on purpose so that I, I end up going back. It's, it's funny though, the guy who cut my hair, he literally asked me, where, where do I norm, normally go to get my hair cut? And I told him, uh, the barbers that I normally go to get my hair cut. And I, I don't know, like, do these barber shops compete with each other or, or are they friends with each other? Do they help each other out? Because I know the record stores in town, the two record stores in town, they help each other out. Like, they don't compete. They literally advertise each other. Say if somebody comes in one record shop and asks for a record and they don't have that record, that record shop will then send them to the other record shop and say, hey, Ha have you tried this other record shop? They might have it, which I think it's fair, you know. I think life's too short to compete, do you know what I mean? Help each other out, be a, 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 a like uh, community, do you know what I mean? That's, thing, that's how I think it should be, me personally, but yeah. I'll say this though, it can't be just me, right? You know when you're in the barbers and the two barbers like start talking to Turkish to each other, right? You can't help but think they might be talking about you, do you know what I mean? You can't help but feel a bit like, because they could easily talk about you because obviously i don't speak turkish so they 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 could easily like speak to each other about me and, I, and i'd not know you know what i mean because i don't know any turkish whatsoever so yeah mate i can't lie i hate that situation you know when you get on the bus and it's full it, it's like absolutely full of people and it feels awkward like sitting next to a stranger you know what i mean you only have to see an extra stranger and the, and, and they like stink or something you know what i mean you sat next to a stranger and they like they smell a bit funky you know what I mean? I hate that situation, man. That just happened to me right now. Like, so I was on the bus and the bus was full of four. Oh my God, here we, here, here we go, here we go. 
it's so dark you can barely see me so it's kind of spooky isn't it you can barely see me but i, I feel like i've come to a bit of like realization and become self-aware that i spend my life i spend a lot of my life in npc territory don't i but as much as i talk shit about npc territory it has everything you know what i mean it has big tesco it's got aldi it's got asda it's got Lidl, it's got chip shops burger king you name it you know what i mean but it's like, you know what I mean? I feel like I just spent my life in NPC territory. And if you've been watching these vlogs, you'll probably notice that. But it's just easy because it's not far from my house. You know what I mean? It's not far from home. And like I said, it, uh, it has a, a lot of things, a lot of great things. So, yeah. Guys, guys, look at this. I'm being healthy for once. I, I'm in my house about to have beans and sausage on toast. Ah, uh, ah. Uh.